Amy from Amy's Resin Corner. Okay, I flipped my mold, my bowl mold inside out, and I have used green orange and oh lord, pink green, mermaid, pink gold, and gold. And I just took them and took my little paintbrush and just dabbed it on everywhere. Then I use Nick Pro Black and in this one, and then in this one I put the gold green blue. So I'm just gonna pour one, then pour the other, and try to make it a quick video. Black, blue, black, blue, black, blue. Black, blue, black, blue, I think this is almost all of the blue there. Let me get my stick. <clears throat> Might as well get the rest of this out. This is supposed to hold 11 ounces and it is from Amazon and it is a less resin mold. I use the uh, the little teeny things there are the flakes. And this is filling it up to the top. I've done 11 ounces exactly. And we will see how this one comes out. I hope it comes out really beautiful. And there we have it. It took a lot longer. I didn't want to waste your time uh, dusting it. It's Chameleon Flakes, less resin. That's the ones I used. So I'm going to put them back in the box. I used every one that was in this, all five colors. So, that, I dusted the inside in the middle and down the middle of the sides, but I left this alone on the outside because I wanted to see these colors and see what it would do. So, that's what we have left, and I will wait probably a couple days, and then I will demold it. I'll try it tomorrow, but... It is kind of late, so it'd be late tomorrow if it is dry. This one looks like it needs a little UV on the side. It's a little low right there. Yeah, it is. 
I didn't think this would come out last week. So, okay, that's my video for today. Trying to get these clean so I can turn this off. I really appreciate everyone that is watching me and all my subscribers. Thank you so much. And uh, ring the bell and you'll know when I come out with another video. My foot's just hurting so bad. I just absolutely can't come out here like I was. And it's getting cold. My foot's just putting knees hurting real bad. Yeah. It took everything in me to walk out here today. Alright, well, I am done. I'm going to throw them away. I'm not going to deal with them today. So that's what I used with that. And I hope it keeps coming like this right here to the middle. I think that is going to be beautiful if it does. I may have stopped it when I sprayed the alcohol. I don't know. But I hope it comes out really pretty. I see all these little bubbles popping though. And they need to pop. Yeah, if you can see right here, you can see it. it's just pop, 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 pop. It's just doing this. So it's really pretty. We'll see how it turns out. I hope it turns out nice. I did paint around this bottom right here on the inside. I painted a, one of the gold uh, chameleon flakes around it. So I hope it gives it kind of a gold ring around the top when we get it out. All right. I will see you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Like, share, comment. Do all the good fun stuff. Share. Like, comment. Yes. Like, just like, like my videos. <laughs> Alright, thank you. And I will see you shortly. Bye for now. Hi, it's Amy. It's the Molding Night. Okay, here we go. Let's see how this turned out. Let's see. Let's see. If I can get it up here. Oh, it's not completely dry. It's bending. We'll bend it back out. It has been pretty cool. So, that would be why it's still bendable. It does have the little gold layer around the top that I wanted. Oh, I wanted that on there so bad. And then you can see where I just brushed some of the other on there. And then the blue's coming through. That blue color, the black is. Look at the sides. There's that blue color. And then you can see the blacks. I could have waited till tomorrow to do this. But I thought it was dry and it was not. So tell me, how do you like this i'm gonna completely have to clean this though it has stuff all in it and i don't know what this was but something got on my 
mold and when I took it off I couldn't get that mark off but that may give it just a good shimmer for the next time I use it or I may um, turn it back and use some clear tape and get it off but I'm really really liking this on the bottom, it did go a little bit more to this side than this side. So, I will have to take my deburrowing tool and I'll just go around this. I'm going to wait till it gets completely hard first. If not, then I'll just take a little sandpaper and I'll just sand it just lightly around it. And get that little place off once it's dried completely. But I, I really like it. I think it turned out beautiful. I think it's beautiful. I really do. I think that is really pretty. Let me know how you like it. Uh, what colors you do or don't like. Um, I'm really liking that the sides. I'm glad I put that color in there. Okay, well, that's it. And I'll wind up putting this to, to the side until it dries. Then I'll clean the bottom. So, thank you all for watching. Um, I have 1,100 people subscribed now. Thank you so much. That took a lot for me to get that done. Especially with my health and me on and off here. And um, I really do appreciate everything that y'all do. So please continue to like, share, subscribe, ring the bell so you'll know when I have a, another video coming out. And let me see. Um. I do want to, um, let me just go to this. I um, do want to give some shout outs. Beating Crazy Custom Creations. Um, let me go down my list. I'm so sorry, y'all. Coral Marines Resin Art. Miss Marine, thank you. Thank you so much for all you or your you watching my videos and I love your channel. Epoxy me that just call me Megan. Patricia's crafting corner. She's new. Check her out. Pouring your heart out, Ju Miss Julie. When I first started doing to do resin on line, I was watching Miss Julie, and I'm not getting them all. But Wanda's blessed creations. Uh, give Wanda a look too because she is so sweet and I love her work. She does a lot of work. So thank you all for watching. God bless you and I will see you on the next one. Bye for now.